Hello. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. How are you today? Good evening, teacher. Hi, thank you. Hello, Mayra. Okay, that's good. That is good, good, good. Okay, Marta Lilian, Glenda, Ruth, Marco, Rodrigo. Okay, people, how was your day? How much to the Good, bad, exciting. Very nice. Very, okay, very nice. That's good. Positive, <laughs> positive. Cansado. Oh, tired, tired. Ah, yes. Tired. I'm tired. I am tired. Yes, I am tired. Okay, so you work a lot, Mayra. Mucho trabajo. <laughs> <laughs> yes. That's, it's, it's, it's impossible, right? To stop. Yes. It's impossible to parar a veces en el trabajo. Siempre sobra para el siguiente día. I don't know why. Yes. We always have more work. No se termina nunca. Yes, it's true. Okay. Yeah, sometimes I say, ay, voy a terminar con esto, esto y esto, termino. Y de repente, mira, hay que hacer esto, otro. Oh, my God. Ya había terminado. <laughs> okay, but yes, it's true. So it's tiring. And time consuming, okay? Consume tiempo. All right, so we have in this moment, this is a, okay, did you practice with the questions? Today we're going to Okay. Ah, eh, antes que se me olvide, si en algún dado caso se me desconectara por cuestión, a ver, hoy porque le digo porque hace un par de minutos Como una hora se me fue la luz así de repente, pero fue dos segundos y regresó, pero ahí se quedó cargando el router, entonces me conecto con el teléfono. Entonces, si ustedes no tienen problemas, permanecen ahí que yo me vuelvo a conectar de una u otra manera, ¿ok? Ok, thank you. En caso de que haya algún bajón o algo, y eso es siempre, o sea, a veces no ha sucedido desde hace rato, pero es raro hubo un apagón en pero para que no, no se vayan a desconectar o crean que el teacher no dejó y ya no vuelve, sí vuelvo. ¿Ok? Ok. Ah, good. Okay. Then, let's see. The, yesterday we were talking about the questions we do. And that's correct. So this one. Okay, I'm going to play the video again and after we're going to do practice we're going to practice okay in groups hi everyone in this class you'll learn how to respond to yes or no questions in the simple present sound additionally you'll practice a conversation about an apartment which illustrates how this topic is used in a real life setting. Let's get started by listening to a conversation. My new apartment. This conversation illustrates how this topic is used in a real life setting. Let's listen and practice. Guess what? I have a new apartment. That's great. What's it like? It's really beautiful. Is it very big? Well, it has a big living room a small bedroom, a bathroom, and a kitchen. Where is it? On Lakeview Drive. Oh, nice. Does it have a view? Yes, it does. It has a great view of another apartment building. Now let's try to understand 
simple present short answers. I would like for you to notice the chart on the screen. Do you live in an apartment? Yes, I do. No, I don't. Do the bedrooms have windows? Yes, they do. No, they don't. Does Chris live in a house? Yes, he does. No, he doesn't. Does the house have a yard? Yes, it does. No, it doesn't. We'll start on the left side of this chart. Let's look at the question Do you live in an apartment? The way we answer this type of question is by saying, Yes, I do, or No, I don't. When responding to yes or no questions, we will typically answer in this way. It's important that we recall a rule that I explained a few lessons ago. The auxiliary to use when forming questions and short answers in the simple present is the following. For the pronouns I, you, we, and they, do, or don't. For the pronouns he, she, and it, does, or doesn't. Now, if you see the example, do the bedrooms have windows? Because we're talking about bedrooms, plural, we're going to use the pronoun they and the auxiliary do or don't. So the answer can be posited by saying, yes, they do. Or negative by saying, no, they don't. Let's analyze one more example. Does Chris live in a house? Because we're talking about Chris, singular, and third person, we're going to use the pronoun he and the auxiliary does or doesn't. So the answer can be positive by saying yes he does or negative by saying no he doesn't. Now it's your turn to practice by making yes or no questions and making short answers. Ask questions about the houses or apartments of your friends, relatives, and co-workers. And make short answers as well. Whenever you finish this task, please share your work in our discussion forums. Okay. Let's see, we have. Uh... Yes, uh, probably try that one. Okay, now um, I will show you the same uh, paper we were we were doing yesterday. This one, right? Now we can practice with these other verbs. But now we can use does. For example, does your your friend dance? Okay, does your girlfriend dance? Then what is uh, an answer here? Yes. She does. 
or no she does she doesn't uh -huh. no she doesn't that's correct okay very good no she doesn't that she dance tango uh-huh okay that's another one and let me see here does she does she dance tango the answer yes yes she does yes she does okay in negative no she doesn't no no she doesn't okay that's good I have a question. Yes. What's the question? About Mata. pronunciation. Mm -hmm. uh, does or does? Does. Does. Not no, does ni does. It's does. Es entre los dos. Okay, does. Okay, does. No say does porque la A sería does. Pero sería does. Okay, does. Does. Does he dance? Mm -hmm. Oh, she dance. It's entre I e O. Does, does she dance? Does she dance tango? You say yes, she does. No, she doesn't. Thank you. Okay, come. Question with come. Does, 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 does she play? No. Does he? Uh, does he what? Does he? Does he come to the supermarket every day? Come. Okay, to the supermarket every day. Okay, the answer. Yes, he does. Yeah, he does. Okay, or no, he does. Okay, good. Now, we're clear with this, right? Remember, we can use she, it, or it. Now, does, does the rain? Teacher podría ser en swim. Does she swim? In the afternoon? Yes. Correct. Does she swim in the afternoon? Again, yes, she does. No, she doesn't. Work? Does he work today? Does it work? Uh, does he is here? Yeah. Uh -huh, yes. Uh -huh. say does he, no, it's okay. Does he work? Sorry. Does he work today? Mm -hmm. Yes. No. Yes. He does. Okay, yes, he does, or no, he does. Eh, el ejemplo que les puse aquí, lo puse porque aquí el work ya no es como trabaja, sino que funciona. Okay, eh, when you say does it work, funciona. Okay, imagínense que encontraron ustedes ahorita un teléfono de esos. Black, un blackberry un blackberry ahí en su gaveta ¿cuál sería la pregunta? Does it work? Does it work? ¿Funciona? ¿Creen que funciona? Yes, I do Yes, it does Okay, work Ah, sí, sí, sí Ajá, No, it doesn't Ok, pero quería que vieran que también el it 
can be used, right? So say yes, it does. No, it doesn't. Funciona, si sí, funciona. Eh, does it work? No, it doesn't. No, no funciona. Okay. Eso puede usarse en un reloj que esté en la pared, right? Hey, does it work? No, it doesn't. It needs a battery. Necesita una batería, right? It needs a battery. Eh, el carro, right? Does it work? No, it doesn't work. It needs gasoline, right? So the car needs gasoline to work. All right? Entonces se puede usar eso. Okay, now I'm going to. Now we're going to do um, some groups. And in the groups, you are going to uh, to ask questions. Como todas las que estuvimos preguntando ayer, do you, do you, do they, do we, do your parents, okay? Que van a hacer tantas preguntas como puedan usando do and does. Okay. Pueden usar las que tenemos ahí en el, en el documento de Word. O pueden utilizar otras. It doesn't matter. Eh, use your... Pueden usar también su, su creatividad, right? Okay. Very important. What else? Teacher. Yes, questions. Uh -huh. Good evening. Good evening. Este, mire, me está fallando el internet. ¿De qué está hablando? Okay. Me disculpo, por favor. No, no hay problema. Vamos a, ahorita voy a hacer unos grupos. Okay, y en los que vamos a practicar eh, las preguntas que hicimos ayer en el documento Word. O sea, van a practicar entre ustedes preguntándose, do you, do you work, do you study, do your parents work, do you live with your parents, eh, do you have sisters, do you have brothers, what eh, do they study, do they eh, swim. Todas las preguntas que le ocurran con do. Y también con does, right? Y también usando does. Okay, questions? Gracias. Sí, gracias. Okay, no problem. All right, so then let me see how many groups we're gonna get. Okay, we have 25 people, now we have groups. Four, six. Okay. Van a ver entre tres y cuatro, right? Three and four people. Okay, here you go. Um, do they understand this class? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Do you finish the lesson? If no, I don't. Yes, I do. <laughs> okay, hello. Hello, teacher. Okay, good. Uh, 
this, what you can do is, para que todos practiquen, eh, Rodrigo, for example, you ask a question to Melvin. You say, Melvin, do you have brothers? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Okay. Then, uh, do your brothers uh, work or study? Um, yes, I do. My brother study. Okay, my brothers study. Okay, my brother study. Okay. Ahí that, sería la respuesta, sí. No. Say, for example, does your brother study? You say, yes, he does. Ah, okay, okay. Yes, he does. Okay. Entonces ahí van practicando okay. la comprensión y la, digamos, y la y el vocabulario, ¿ok? Entonces van siguiendo una secuencia de preguntas. Ahora, Melvin, you can ask Elsie, le puede preguntar a Elsie. Elsie, do you have children? Uh, the microphone, your microphone. El micrófono. <laughs> <risa> yes, eh, estaba correcta la respuesta pero no se lo oía solo lo miramos que hacía <risa> ok yes I do I do yes, no. yes yes I do do you have children yes I do ok yes I do ajá correcto ok ahora usted pregúntele a Rafael um, do you drink Coca-Cola. Uh, yes, I like Coca-Cola. <laughs> okay. Esa es otra respuesta, right? Yes, I like Coca-Cola. Es otra una posible respuesta. No problem. Okay, Rafael. Oh, yes, I do. Oh, yes, I do. Yes, okay. La otra respuesta larga, la otra respuesta corta. Yes, I do. Short. Yes, I like Coca-Cola is long answer. No problem. No problem. Ok, eh, Rafael, ask Rodrigo. Rodrigo, do you like chicken? No. Okay. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Perfecto. Ahora traten de hacer preguntas no repitiendo los verbos, ok, para que practiquen otros. Ok, ya practicamos like, have, eh, ahora pregunten, do you work, do you study, eh, do you swim, ok, do you swim in the morning, other verbs. Okay, continue practicing. Very good. Thank you. All right. TV? Yes, I do. Um, do you play soccer? <laughs> no. No, I don't. Hello. Hello, Mayra. Hola, teacher. Yo estoy sola, no hay nadie conmigo. Yo subí yo que le dejaron sola, dije, ve. Eh, qué mala gente. Yo tengo, yo tengo unas preguntas. Go, ask me, pregúntame. A ver, a ver si no le da risa lo que le voy a preguntar. <laughs> ok. Do you play basketball? Ok, yes, uh, no, I don't. No. No. Um, I don't like it. I don't like it very much. I like to I like to watch. Ah, se me descargaron los audífonos a ver si lo voy a oír. Okay. So now? Do you read a good book? Oh, yes, I do. Do you read in the Bible? The Bible? Yes, I do. The Psalms. Psalm Bible. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes, the Psalms. Este, do your brother swim in the morning? Eh, no, he doesn't. I don't have a brother. Sí, me imaginé. <laughs> ¿Por, ¿Por qué? No sé, porque desde que me dijo no, dije yo, ah, no, de tener hermano, quizás. Oh, yes, yes, no, no, I yo don't. Yo tengo un amigo, profe, que es igualito a usted. Oh, really? Sí. Así, igualito, igualito. Sí, dicen que hay como siete caras conocidas en el mundo, así que le creo. <laughs> Ahí en Santa sí. Tecla vive, a ver si no lo conocerá. No, I don't think so. Oh, probably. What's his name? Huh? What's his name? Is Julio Arevalo. Julio, Julio. Well, no. Well, that's no. no. No, me suena. No, me suena. <laughs> no el nombre sí, pero. Ahí le voy a enseñar una foto. Okay, good. 
Pero se va a asustar y va a decir, soy yo. Es mí. <risa> my, my twin brother. Ajá. Okay. Así es que ella right. tiene un hermano. Ok. La perfect. otra que hice, Ajá. pero no sé si está bien esta. Porque si se refiere a la mamá, tiene que ser das. Yes. Mm -hmm. Entonces podría ser, does your mother chicken? Does your mother, eh, le falta el verbo. Ah, cooking. Uh, does your mother cook chicken? Uh -huh. Cook chicken. Ah, oh, okay. Does your mother cook chicken? Is it? Yes, she does. Yes. Do you like studying English? Yes, I do. I love it. Me too. <laughs> okay. And what else? Another question? Do Roberto and you jump rock? Uh, do Roberto and you? Jump rock. Uh, es que no sé cómo se pronuncia. De saltar okay. jump, uh -huh. Yes, jump, jump. Uh, yes, we do. Yes, we okay. do. Okay. Do they play cards? Do they play cards? Yes, they do. Yes, Solo they... esa logré hacer. Okay, good. Then let me... Vamos a traer un invitado para acá. Es que ahí me cuestan los verbos, profe. Este, pero ¿le, cu ¿le cuesta recordarlos o le cuesta...? No, tengo que aprendérmelos. Ah, ok. okay. Tengo que aprendérmelos. Dicen sí. que hay que aprenderse cinco, aunque sea diario. Por lo menos, por lo menos para que sienta usted la... Eh, y se van repasando. Y luego... Pero mañana que... le prometo que voy a empezar. Ok. <risa> no, no, ahora. <risa> ahora voy a empezar. Sí, mañana no, mañana no le creo. Ahora okay. en la noche voy a estar ahí. Ajá, no, pero mire, con cinco verbos y así en preguntas, como lo hicimos ayer. Entonces uh -huh. usted va a do you play, do you work, do you study, do you see, do you like. Va a esos cinco hoy y lo repite, lo repite y hace varias oraciones. Y luego, uh -huh. ya mañana, ajá, mañana repasa esos cinco y agrega otros cinco. Uh -huh. Hay que irlas agregando a Exacto. la lista. Exacto, ajá, así ajá, es como se va bien. haciendo la... Se va incrementando claro. la memoria y se va incrementando también el, el conocimiento. Eso haré a partir de ahora, entonces. Ok, va, mira, y le dejo a Ingrid bueno. para que practiquen. Do you, do you. Ay, gracias. Que, que en gusto, chambreando en inglés. No, <risa> yo he chambreé en inglés, ya estuvo bueno aquí el chicle. Ah, okay. <risa> All right, continue. Hola, Ingrid. Hola. Hello, Ingrid. Hola. Hello. Hello. Oh, ok, that's good. Cool. <risa> No sé si quieren seguir practicando. Yes, 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 continue, continue. Ok. <laughs> Don't stop. Ok, did you practice do and does? Tengo dos preguntas más. Ok. Uh, no sé quién me la voy a responder igual otra. Este, do you like classical music? Yes, oh, I, I do. do. Um, do you like... To be fashionable, 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 ¿Cómo? ¿Cómo? fashionable, fashionable, uh -huh. fashionable. Uh, okay. Do you like to be fashionable? Y se va a sentar a ver qué. ¿Cómo se traduce? Ah, ¿te gusta estar de moda? moda? A la moda. Uh -huh. sí, Okay, no, good. I don't. No, I don't. Yes, I do. In my case, yes, I do. Yes, I do. Okay, good. Then uh, practice, try to practice with different verbs, okay? Try with different verbs. Thank you. Tienen que hacer este wash machine. Sí, suena como lavadora de ropa. Bien, sir. Pero detrás. Pues que tendría que hacer otro plato o algo así. Dish washer. Dish washer. Dish washer. Dish washer. Thank you. Gracias. Como el wash and wear. So dish washer. Dish washer. Dish es trastes y el washer es la lavadora. Dish washer. Dish washer. Dish washer. Does the dish washer work? Do you have a Do you have a dishwasher? No. 
No, no, I don't. I... no, I don't. Okay. In my I house, don't have one. here in my yeah. house, I am the dishwasher. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I in am, my house too. I, I, I am the machine. <laughs> yes. No, no, but, uh, in my house, I am the machine. Yes, you're the <laughs> machine, right? Machine. Yes, me too. In my house, you're the machine. I love. Yes. And you, Tati? How about you, Tatiana? Yes, I have washing machine. <laughs> washing machine, but in the dishwasher too. Yes. Okay. Good. That's nice. Okay. Great. Okay, what other questions? Alguna duda? Questions about do or does? Mm, no, teacher. No questions. Okay, good. Questions. Well, practice a little bit and then uh, two more minutes and then we go back to the main session, okay? Okay. Okay. All right. Thank you. Hi. Hello, hello. Hi. Hello. Hello, teacher. Hello. Okay, no problem. Everything okay? No, no problem. No problem. Estamos intentándolo hacer okay. lo mejor que se pueda. Yeah, that's good. That's good. That's good. Yes, esa es la idea, right? Yes. Try. Sí. Try to do the best. Thank you. Eh, no, no, que no importa si hay errorcitos o no. Doesn't matter. Practice, practice. Question? No, no, no questions. Yes. No, no questions. No, no. Okay. Ya, yeah, unos dos minutos regresamos, ¿ok? Ok, thank you. What in the morning? Do you write a uh, manejar en la mañana? Eh, what, caminar, no sé. Do you ah, walk? walk? Do you walk? Walk, uh -huh. walk. Walk in the morning? Yes, I do. Um, do you speak two language? Do you speak English? Oh, do you speak English? Uh -huh. Yes, I do. Do, do you play soccer today? No, I don't. Um, do you um, no say like a pizza? <laughs> um, yes. What do you mean? What do you mean no say? <laughs> yeah, it's kind of, it is kind of slow. Huh? ¿Cómo sería esa? <laughs> no, ¿Cómo sería esa? Pero sí, pero es, do, you, do you like, no sé, like a pizza? <laughs> no, no, no. Do you like, do you like pizza? Okay, do you like pizza? Or you can say, for example, in English, you can say, do you like, um, I don't know, pizza? Okay. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Uh -huh, but no, 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 no sé, right? In English, you say it in English. Okay, good. Now, that's a good question. Do you like pizza? Well, in my case, yes, I do. Okay, yes, I do. Yes, I, I do. I love pizza. I love pizza. Okay. I love pizza. Mm -hmm. Pizza is more. Hey, when you say I love pizza, cuando se lo dice a una persona es como amar, right? Pero uh -huh. cuando se habla de cosas es como me encanta. Okay, when you say mm -hmm. I love pizza, me encanta la pizza. Okay, you say, I love my wife, I'm on my esposa. I love my children, I'm on my hijos. I love my husband, so that's where I'm on my esposo. Things like that, okay? But uh, when you say objetos, so, yeah, so let's say things, then you say, I like, uh, I like reading or opciones. I like reading, me encanta leer. I like uh, playing, me encanta jugar. Okay? Okay. Very good. Yes. Okay. Okay. Uh, Thanks. Thank you. Everybody's coming back.
Okay, okay, okay. Where are the other 20? Yes, here they are. Hello, teacher. Okay, yes, here we are. Hi, Melvin. Okay, uh, how was the experience? Any questions? Any doubts? Uh, did you practice many verbs? Okay, remember that the idea of this uh, exercise siempre es practicar la mayor cantidad de verbos que puedan y que no sean los de siempre, right? Okay, for example, we have to use this and look, jump, run, uh, eat, uh, we can also use write, uh, understand, know, uh, rain, snow, uh, for example, uh, eat, uh, throw, lanzar, throw a ball, hit a ball, drive, drive, drive a car, ride a Ride a horse, uh, you can use also use kiss, uh, hawk, abrazar, hawk. Okay, the idea is to create a vocabulary and force, force your brain, force our brain to think and produce more English, right? Si usamos casi siempre los verbos, nuestro cerebro se acomoda. Okay. Entonces, la idea es sacar al cerebro y a la mente del, la, del comfort zone, una zona de, de, de acomodo, right? Push it and, and force, okay? Eso es de forzarlo. Okay, so then, and one way to do it is, eh, eh, Mayra was telling me, me estaba dando mi idea, que es bueno muy buena, que es aprender por lo menos cinco y diez verbos diarios. Practicarlos, right? Ustedes pueden cinco verbos hoy, son diez, depende del tiempo que tengan, pueden ser cinco mínimo, diez máximo. Y los practican hoy, así con las preguntas que hemos hecho hoy o con oraciones, right? Tomorrow, practican, solo repasan esos diez y escogen otros diez verbos, right? Y ahí se van a ir viendo que, que a, la vez, a medida van usando los verbos, sirve porque va, se van a dar cuenta que a veces... No todas las palabras se pueden usar con ciertos verbos, right? And then that's the, that's the important thing. Okay, good. Eh, one more thing. Una pregunta más. La, eh, ¿Cómo se consienten para entender las indicaciones y todo lo que cuando yo se las doy en inglés? Del 1 al 10. Cuando habla despacio se entiende, cuando habla rápido no. Ok, bueno, perfecto. ¿Qué más? Hey. La verdad es que yo le doy bien. bien. Ok, vale. Eh, les pregunto esto que vamos a tratar ahorita, de ahora en adelante, voy a tratar de hablarles más en inglés, ok. Yo creo que ya nos acomodamos, ya, ya nos conocimos. Entonces, este, vamos, este, y pero eso que alguien que me dijeron acá, por ejemplo, si sienten que voy muy rápido, me dicen, teacher, can you repeat, please? Could you repeat that, please? And then I stop, and then yo voy a entender que porque iba muy rápido o algo, y lo hago más lento, okay? No problem? Okay. okay. Very good. No okay. problem. Y cuando, no, y cuando algo también no se entienda por el vocabulario o algo, me lo dice, mire, eh, es esto, okay? Y, o significa esto, o esto es lo que quiere decir, right? Y así... Oh, Spanish, please. Ah, okay, very oh, good. Spanish, please. No Spanish, please. Okay, María José. No problem, okay. no Spanish, no more. Okay, the Spanish die today. Okay, <laughs> okay very good. All right, so then uh, let's see. Okay, there is something in the chat. Okay, Rafael, no Rafael, tomorrow no class. Okay, tomorrow Señorita. no no class. Teacher. Yes. Fíjese que no sé si será mi dispositivo, pero a veces se le escucha como lejano. Ajá. ¿Verdad? Entonces, y a veces sí se le escucha más cercano. Entonces, no Va. sé. Y la, la señal, porque igual a mí se escucha Quiero así ver. como que se le corta la voz. Se le um, va. Vamos a ver una cosa. Ahorita, ¿cómo se escucha? 
Ahorita se escucha oh, bien. Excelente. Sí, ahorita sí. excelente. ¿Y ahora? Sí, a mí también me pasa. ¿Y ahora cómo se escucha? Se oye muy bien. Good. Mejor, ah, mejor. Pasa, son good, dos cosas. Good, good. Un Hay poco más suave, pero se escucha. Ah, ok. Es que eso se, se escucha más suave a veces porque a veces me lo quito de acá. Porque cuando pongo los dos, o sea, ese me incomoda un poco. Entonces me lo dejo hasta aquí abajo. Y aquí es donde lo ah, pongo menos. Eh, me lo, pero me lo dicen. Y lo que hago a veces okay. es que lo pongo acá y ya me queda más cerca. Entonces ah, aquí es donde se oye, se oye mejor. Entonces así uh -huh. que me ve como que tengo aquí un earring. No, pero no es arito. No es arito. Entonces con eso ya me lo sostengo. Ya, póngase, profe. ¿Ah? Sí, ya. Una argolla, póngase en la oreja y ahí lo mismo. Sí, un, un piercing. <risa> good idea, good idea. Yes, I, I like that. O sea, una, para aquellas grandotas que estén así, ¿no? Sí, tipo uh -huh. en África. Y me sale por aquí y me lo saco por este lado. Good, good idea. Ok. Una expansiva. Ah, ah, ok. Ah, that's the name. Ok, expansiva, that's the name. Ok, very good. Ok, then uh, we're going to go to the platform again. Ah, pero before I want to take a picture, I went to the attendance, the asistencia, right? I'm going to... Lista para la foto. Ready for the picture. Yes. Now, wait a minute. Wait a minute. I think we have one twenty-five today. Okay, there we go. This is the first one. Okay. Thank you very much. Okay, now we're going to go back to the lesson. And we go to the platform. Okay, so that, this was the video, and now we have the next one. And here, Marta Lillian, could you please read the instructions here in the knowledge check? Okay. Complete the conversation. Select the option that completes the two blanks fills in each sentence or question. Or questions, okay. So here, what we have to do is there is a sentence that is not complete, okay, incomplete. And then we have two choices, okay, two words. Then we have to see, do you live? Does, does you live? Do you live or does you live? Which is the correct one? Does live. Does? This one? Do live, do live, do live, do live. This one. Do live. No. Do do live. Do live. Yes. That one. Yes. Okay. Do yes. Do, do live. Yes. Do you live? Mm -hmm. Do you live? All right. Um. What about this one, Chris? No. No. I, I don't. Don't, don't. No. I don't live. Don't live. No, I don't. Live. Okay. No, I don't. I live in a house. No, I don't. I live in a house. Yes. Okay. What about Linda? What about Linda? Um, you have it. You have it. Does it have a jerk? Does. 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 Do does it have? Does it have? Okay. That is have. Does it have a jar? Uh -huh. Does it have a jar? 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 Yes. Very good. Very good. Does it have a jar? Next one. Yes, I do. Yes. yes. It, it does. It does. No, it does. Yes, yes, it does. Yes, yes. it does. Sorry. It, it does. Yeah. Uh -huh. Linda, that sounds nice. That sounds nice. Do you live alone? Do you, do you live? 
Do you live alone? Do you live alone? Do you live alone? Do you live alone? I don't. I live with my family. With my family. Yes. No, I don't. I live with my family. No, I don't. I live with my family. Linda, do you have? 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 Do you have, mm -hmm. do you have any brothers or sisters? Okay. And the board of sisters. Yes, yes I, do. I, I do. I have. Do I have, have four four sisters? sisters? Yes, I do. I have four sisters. Four cuatro hermanas. Very good. Uh -huh. Yes, four sisters. The next one. Really, 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 your house have no s do and no because it's one house it's singular porque se está refiriendo al caballo no house no house. la casa no mm. casa la casa <laughs> yes it's a house it's <laughs> one house okay and if it is horse okay if it is horse it's always one if it is one horse I say that, uh -huh. yes, that is house. Excellent. Teacher. Yes. Yo tengo una pregunta que más que todo es una confusión. ¿Cuál es la diferencia en decir home, home? ¿Y cuál es la otra? Home y house. Yes, home and house. Okay, the house is the construction, is the building. Okay, the house mm -hmm. is the... The, the building that you can see. The home, the home is more uh, abstract. The home is your your mother, your father, your brother. Your uh -huh. Uh -huh, exactly. Right? Then the, the people and the feelings around. Okay. Okay. Uh, all, all those feelings. Yes, that's the. Teacher. Yes. Teacher, eh, tengo una duda con este, cómo diferencio el See, look, and watch. See, look, and watch. Okay, see is uh, the general thing. Okay, see is the bear. Uh, if you have eyes, if I have two eyes, we can see. Okay? Uh, you can say, for example, the, the act of uh, seeing something is the last one that bear. Bear, see. When you see something, look is when uh, the point that you are. Uh, for example, in this moment, I am looking at you. I look at you. Okay. Sí, okay. Es hacia donde dirijo mi vista, right? I look at you. And watch, watch is observe. Okay, I, it's observe. For example, I am watching you, right? I am watching you. I am like vigilar, observar, right? It is more, more concentration, watch. Look is more, for example, when you are, you know, looking at something, look at the wall, uh -huh, like, no solo mirar, simple mirar. Buscar. And uh, ver, ver is when you say see. Si es el, si tenemos dos ojos, por ejemplo, una persona no vidente, no ve, don't, doesn't see, okay? Uh -huh. uh, but I can see, yo sí puedo ver. Y te puedo usar, for example, if, uh, si usted apaga tu cámara y le dice, oh, Stephanie, I don't see you. No la veo. Yeah, I don't ah, see yeah. you. Okay. And now, cuando la enciende, le dice, okay, I see you now. Okay. Okay, okay. But I have a question. Thank yes. you. Con esta que acabamos de responder, no debería ser as many bedrooms. 
Eh, sí, porque estamos hablando de la casa. Uh -huh. If it is affirmative, yes. But in this case, it's a question. Okay. Y cuando usamos la question, we have does, auxiliary verb, and have. No, es has. No, in this case, no, because we are using the auxiliary verb. Estamos hablando okay. en de la casa. Uh -huh. Does your house have? Singular. Uh, wait, wait. So I show you. Porque el has es para he, she, it, ¿verdad? Yes. Esa es, teacher. I told you this. Uh, es que das, es que das ya me está indicando que estamos en tercera persona, entonces no es necesario sí. cambiar el has. Uh, exactly, that's correct. Has many rooms. Okay, in this case, eh, Rodrigo, the, it's affirmative sentence. In the affirmative sentence, say the house has many rooms. Okay. Uh -huh. In the question form, you say does the house. Okay, it, mm -hmm. the has is in does. Does the house, they hear you say have. Okay, many, thank you. Many rooms. Okay, is that clear? Thank you very much. Okay, no problem. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, affirmative. <coughs> yes. Okay. Negative. No. Negative. 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 Okay, the negative. Yes. Okay. The house doesn't have many rooms. Many rooms. Okay. Then only in the affirmative. Good. Excellent. Good questions. Very nice. Thank you, Rodrigo. Okay, next one. Thank Chris. You. Okay. Chris, the next one. It does. Has. Yes. Chris. It does. Yes, yeah, sorry. Okay, yes. Yes, it does. It yes. has. Okay. It Look. does. It has. This it is the house. Has. The it here is the house. It in the house. Yes. Yes, it does. It has four. Linda. El, el punto hace la diferencia here. Have. Exactly. Yes. Yeah. Do here begins the, the answer, and this is the sentence. Do you have your own bedroom? Do you, you have your own bedroom? Do you own bedroom? Okay. Very good. Do you good. have your own bedroom? Yes, very good. Nice pronunciation. He do. I yes. do. Yes, I do. I do. Yes, I do. I am really lucky. I'm really lucky. I'm really? I'm really lucky. So really? Mm -hmm. re really lucky. 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 I'm really lucky. Lucky. Mm -hmm. I'm really lucky. Yes, very good. Nice. Excellent. Okay, yes, I do. I'm really lucky. Okay, now surprise. Mm -hmm. Let's get to see here. Wow, people. Very oh. good, very good. Excellent. Excellent. Congratulations. Very good. Congratulations. Mm -hmm. Yes. Good yes. job. Very, very excellent job. Great. Great job. Okay. Good. You know, this is a a kind of a uh, difficult sometimes you know do does the questions uh, right now you understand the the concept right you have the idea the structure now you have you have to continue practicing right because that's also very important right to practice every day. because in that way you don't re you don't forget you don't forget the the structure the correct order of the words good very nice now this was the knowledge check. Look how many, we're like 10. Okay, knowledge. and in the next one. Hey, Elsa, Elsa, Natalia, would you please read the, the objective here? Okay, by the end of the, this class, you will learn vocabulary for, for furniture, furniture, and other house 
household items. Items. Very good. I items. Items. Good. Okay. okay. So here. La palabra teacher furniture son muebles. Mm -hmm. That's correct. Mm -hmm. The bed, the sofa, the armchair, the table, all the furniture in the house. Mm -hmm. okay. That's correct. Items. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Okay, this so in this one we are going to check vocabulary, right? Vocabulary. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm going to play the video. Uh, le voy a pedir que apaguen el micrófono, el micrófono, so that we can listen to the video. This is vocabulary. Look, pay attention to the pronunciation, okay? Pronunciation is important here. Hi, everyone. In this class, you'll learn vocabulary, furniture, and other household items. Let's Very get started listening and repeat the vocabulary. Okay. Armchairs, stove, curtains. Okay, okay. Let me see if uh, we can improve that one. Hi, everyone. In this class, you'll learn vocabulary. Thank you. Now, yes? Very good. Okay. Yes. Thank you. Sport, furniture and other household items. Let's get started by listening and repeating the vocabulary. Armchairs. Stove, curtains, pictures, clock, bed, table, coffee table, microwave oven, refrigerator, lamps, sofa, desk, bookcase, dresser, Chairs, mirror, rug, television. Other vocabulary that is important to understand is kitchen, dining room, living room, bedroom. And now we we'll practice using the vocabulary that we just heard by making statements about your kitchen, mm -hmm. dining room, living room, and bedroom. For example, my living room has a sofa, a rug, and a television. My dining room has, after you complete this exercise, please share your work in our discussion forums. Bookcase. Okay, so this is the vocabulary that we have. Okay, it says arm armchairs. And these are the two armchairs. Mm -hmm. Then you have stove. Okay, a stove is this machine, right? For cooking, machine, stove. Then we have curtains. Curtain. Curtain. Pero te vas a tomar la facha porque la vez pasada no te la tomas. Pictures. Pero te la tomas que hago. Clock. Clock. Bed. Lamp. Lamp. Desk. Desk. Sofa. The sofa. Then we have the refrigerator. Okay, refrigerator. Microwave oven, table, coffee table, bookcase, bookcase, dresser, dresser, chairs, mirror, rug. And television, television, the television. Then we have the desk, bed, clock, lamp, picture, and curtain. Uh -huh. Here we don't pronounce curtains, okay, or curtain, not cur curtains. Curtains. 
Mm, mm, curtain. Okay, mm. so that's the sound. Okay, questions about the. Uh, I mean, I think it's clear, right? With the vocabulary. Question. Coffee table. The coffee table, huh? Here? Yes, it's in the middle of this living room. Okay. Okay, okay. Exactly, Mayra, that's correct. Yes. Yes, Rodrigo? Bookcase is a libre, librera. Mm -hmm. That's correct. Thank you. Okay. It's a, then, uh, for example, in the case of the bookcase, you can have a, a you can have a bookcase, shoe, shoe case, and a zapatera, right? You have shoe case where you can put the shoes. And the coffee table, and you also have the night table. Okay. No mesita noche, right? That you can have next to your bed. Okay, what else? Dresser e gavetero. Mm -hmm. Is this one? Usually is in the bedroom. Okay, and this is for for keeping the jewels or clothes. Okay. Personal clothes. Your personal clothes is in these drawers. Okay, drawers. Okay, so here, if you see in the dresser, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven drawers, seven drawers. That's an vestido dresser. Uh huh. It is como they call, that's where they put this for clothes. Uh, I don't know. There are different names in Spanish. Como le llaman acá? Le llaman gavetero. Gavetero. Comoda, comoda, creo que le dicen in some places. Generalmente eh, gavetero. Ajá, yes. Y en some of them have a mirror. Algunos tienen un espejo aquí arriba que se ocupa en las habitaciones. ¿Cómo le llaman? Como tocador. Tocador. Eh, that's the word. Tocador. Esa es la palabra, tocador. Ok, because it's the, that's the dresser. Ok, es donde se termina de vestir. Ok, that's the dresser. Ok. Good. That's what I call teamwork to discover vocabulary. Okay, no, no questions? No, no, no questions. questions. Excellent. Question. No okay. homework? Yes, the homework for tomorrow, you know, first one, dreaming, okay? The first one is dreaming, and the second one is practice, look at the, in your, tomorrow we're going, you're going to describe, describe the objects in your, uh, in, it can be in the living room, in the dining room. Tomorrow we're going to yeah. talk about the places in the house. The kitchen, in the kitchen, what you have in the kitchen, what you have in the living room, in the bedroom, My bedroom. Uh, in the bathroom, okay? My so garage. To, yeah, the garage, uh -huh, exactly, in the backyard, in the front yard. Yeah. Okay. But, tom but tomorrow is Wednesday. <laughs> oh, yeah, tomorrow, tomorrow is Friday. No, yes, it's for Monday. For Monday, yes. Mañana no hay class. Yes, tomorrow. Yes. Ya yeah, me había emocionado. Yeah. Friday. La class tomorrow. Okay, good. Bueno, lo que quieras es conecte, no hay plática. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so then I'll see okay. you on Monday. Okay, see you Monday. Have a nice see weekend. See you on Monday. Thank you very much. Bye. 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 Bye.